Hello everyone, this is the promotion video for the web conference 2024's results paper track. The title is Can Large Language Model Substitute Human Labeling? A case study of fan group in Chinese address entity recognition dataset for UAV delivery. I'm Sichuan Luo, a PhD student from the City University of Hong Kong. So, large language models has shown remarkable neural language understanding and generation abilities in recent years. So, for example, models such as the GPT-4 can understand and generate according to human instructions. And the large language models have been used to uh, label English dataset in previous works. However, Using large language models for labeling Chinese dataset is underexplored. So this raises a question: Can large language models support human performance in labeling fan green Chinese dataset with superior quality? To answer this question, in this paper we present CNER UAV, which is a fan green Chinese NER dataset for the UAV delivery task. Specifically, uh, this dataset consists of five categories ranging from buildings to rooms. It, al it allows for fan green segmentation of Chinese address. The dataset contains about uh, 12,000 labeled samples, and the raw data were collected from the Meituan UAV delivery systems, representing the actual data distribution. Uh, we annotated the dataset using both the human annotators and large language models, including GPT 3.5 and Treasury M model. And, and this results in three subsets. We conduct an experiment on all subsets to evaluate their performance with various baseline models. By comparing these datasets, we have determined that where large, large language models can serve as a supplementary annotation tools they cannot entirely substitute manual annotation for fan green Chinese NER in UAV delivery task. And here is an example of our labeled dataset. For more details, please refer to our original paper. And thank you for listening.